Hi, I'm Bernie Thompson. I'm the founder of Pluggable Technologies, and we're really excited today to be launching a new docking station with this new UD6950H docking station, we've really focused on that compatibility aspect. USB is evolving. It's evolving from the USB connector that we've known up until now, the USB-A connector to the USB-C connector. Uh, but that's caused a problem uh, that you've got to know what type of laptop you have in order to know what dock to buy. And so we've tackled that problem with this dock. The dock itself has a USB-C connector, but comes bundled also with a C to A connector. So it'll work with any of your laptops, USB-C or USB-A, uh, as long as they're running Windows. So if you're a Mac user, this dock is not for you because Mac OS doesn't support the DisplayLink technology that's used inside of this dock. We've also tackled one of the other kind of confusing compatibility problems for people today, which is if you buy a monitor, you've got to be careful. It might be HDMI or DisplayPort, and it, it makes a difference because they're different connectors with different cables. So what we've done with this dock is we've gotten rid of that worry for you. We have both HDMI and DisplayPort connectors on the dock. We've got two of each, and you can use either two HDMI monitors, two DisplayPort monitors, or one of each. Either way, you'll be able to connect two displays through this dock, and you don't need to worry about whether they're HDMI or DisplayPort. There are older monitors out there that support some older graphics connectors, including VGA and DVI, and this dock can support those too with adapters that you can buy that are not included in the box. So this dock has six USB ports, so you can connect in any device uh, that you want. All of your USB flash drives, your keyboard, your mouse, all goes into the dock and then one cable back to your PC. It also has wired uh, Ethernet, so you can get faster than wireless speeds uh, when you're connecting to the Internet. And it has audio, so you can use any of your microphones or headsets uh, connected right into the dock. You have a really great desk setup. In addition, of course, to those two extra monitors. So basically with one cable back to your uh, Windows PC, you're getting back all of that connectivity, all of those ports um, that those uh, laptops have been losing as they've been getting smaller and lighter and thinner. If you're a Chromebook user, this dock actually will work, but because it's a high-end dock with high-end uh, display features, not all of those features may be available on your Chrome OS system, so we'd recommend some of our other existing docks, like our best-selling UD3900 dock for Chromebook users. If you're wanting a dock that will charge your laptop, Charging laptops is only possible over USB-C. It's not possible over USB-A. Uh, this dock, because it has the exact same feature set over USB-A or USB-C, does not do laptop charging. So if you're a, a graphics enthusiast and you've got some high-end monitors that are 4K or even 5K monitors, uh, this dock will work in most of those scenarios. But here's what you need to know. HDMI 2 is required in order to get 4K 60 Hertz, uh, and you need the monitor and the cable between the monitor and the dock to both support HDMI 2. And then the dock itself, it, it will support 4K 60 Hertz on any laptop, including even laptops that don't natively have 4K 60 Hertz support built in, which is pretty cool that through the dock you can do some things that your laptop might not even be capable of. Well, what if you have an HDMI 1.4 setup? Well, so then you're going to be able to do 4K still, but it'll be at 30 Hertz. And people sometimes ask, okay, so am I going to notice the difference between 30 Hertz and 60 Hertz, which basically means the, the screen is refreshing the images on there 60 times a second or 30 times a second. And the answer is you will notice it for some scenarios, like if you're doing gaming or you're doing video editing, but the dock's not really for those scenarios anyway. Uh, the display link technology that's in this dock that's running over USB is more for the information worker uh, type scenario. And for that scenario, you're often not going to notice the difference difference between 30 and 60 hertz. So if you have a uh you know, 4K display that is HDMI 1.4 only and, and therefore is only capable of 30 hertz. Um, you should know that, but you're probably going to be happy with the dock anyway. 